that move back. No, it's okay. 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 The High Chief, all other food courts of Zal. First, I'm glad to be here today to be part of this ceremony. And I want to thank you two people who have come out in great number. Who have come out in great number for this ceremony. Like the Honorable Commissioner said, this is a program, a project being put up by private investment. I need to emphasize that. It's a tourism center. It's one of the places that is being put up to ensure that Delta State grows an economy that is outside oil or that is not totally dependent on oil. Now, I need to emphasize that it is in partnership with the state government. The state government has its role to play. And the role the state government is playing is first of all, through the community, provide the land, and then the construction of this bridge and the road is being funded by the state government. Now, to ensure that the project is not abandoned, that money is not the issue, the state government has saved money for this project. So it is not going to be an abandoned project and money is not going to be an issue as far as construction of the road and bridge is concerned. But the real project itself is being funded by Sana Group who are bringing in over 40 billion naira. And the plan of this project has taken over one year because we wanted to ensure that they have the money before coming to do this ceremony. We insisted that they must get the money before coming here. It's not coming here and say we are going to look for money. So the money for the road and the bridge, that money is ready by the state government. And the money for the real project itself is ready by Sana Group. I need to emphasize this because people keep asking me, what do you do with Delta State money? Uh, this is one of the things where would they, where would they keep the money for? So I want to thank the community. I want to thank Salad Group. And let me just tell the community, I heard what they were reading in terms of demands. And the acting governor, I just replied to his ears. He said, go to look into some of the issues that have been raised. But this project will bring an overwhelming development community and to do. In fact, all the things you don't talk about for this your paper, that small thing compared to which they call. Because what started in the state of Florida was a project like this. A tourism project. The things that we come, it is not just cottage hospital that we come, but even bigger hospitals I'm sure we come. Bigger markets will come, bigger schools will come. Because of the influx of people into this area, all those things will just come in naturally. And I'm sure both worry and through will start moving towards this area in terms of development. It has happened in other places before, and it will happen in this in this community. All we require. All that is required is for the community to please ensure that the construction is not delayed by unnecessary demands and stoppage of work. There has to be cooperation from the community, there has to be cooperation from the people. Because what is coming is very, very big, and by the grace of God, it will come in Jesus' name. Oh, better than that. Why you here? Every coin you run out of here.